understanding new Facebook insights. Few weeks back, Facebook Page Insights received a new facelift and has been rolling out to everyone across the world. The new Facebook Insights displays more information than the previous version and is a breath of fresh air. It has broken up the dashboard into four main sections overview, page, posts and people. Let's take a deeper look at each of these. Overview. This section gives you a 7 day snapshot of your page's performance. Similar to the old insights, you can see the overall page likes, reach and engagement. Here you can also check out the performance of your 5 most recent posts detailed with stats about reach, post clicks, likes, comments and shares. The overview section is pretty straightforward and features a more visually attractive layout. Page The page section is filled with information about how your fan base has grown and how people are connecting with your page. There is a ton of information that is divided into three parts. Page likes, post reach and page visits. In the page likes section, you will find information about your page likes including total likes, net likes and where your likes came from. This information is great when you need to really get down to the nitty gritty about how your community grows and where the growth comes from. Post Reach The Post Reach section digs deeper into your content's reach and actions that influence it. Here you will find Post Reach Engagement actions that influence reach Negative engagements such as hide, report as spam and unlikes and overall reach. Now there will be no speculations if your client asks you why there is a decrease in post reach. You can point them to the exact reason. Page visits. This section shows you information about what sections of your page get viewed the most including page tabs. There is also very useful information included here such as other page activity which outlines, mentions, posts by other people on your page, check-ins and offers purchased. Finally, a nice little graph outlines the number of times people came to your page from outside of Facebook. This is all great information for when you are trying to understand where your Facebook traffic is coming from. Posts In the post section, Facebook provides you with major information about all posts, when your fans are online, and best post types. This section is a major improvement and provides a ton of great data. Under all posts, you will find the basic breakdown of all your page posts. The data points include reach, post clicks and engagements. When your fans are online, this graph shows you when your fans are online. This answers that magical question about when is the best time to post. This proves that there is no magic standard and optimal post timings are unique to each page. Best post types. Always wanted to know the success of different post types? 
Well, now you can. The best post type sections shows data based on average reach and engagement. People. The section for people allows you to compare the demographics of people who have liked your page with the overall demographics of Facebook's total population. The data here is split up into three parts. Your fans, people reached and people engaged. Your fans. Here you will find basic demographic data including age and gender, location and language, people reached. This part shows you the demographics of people who saw your content compared against the rest of your fans. People engaged. Here you will find information about the demographics of people who engaged with your posts compared with the overall demographics of your fans. To summarize, the new Facebook Insights is a huge improvement from the previous version and will help page managers big time. What do you think about the new Facebook Page Insights? Do you like it? Don't like it? Share your opinion in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more such insightful videos.